Hello everybody and welcome to my co-op two player camp <laughs> my co-op campaign with Jonas Snee. Hello, hello. Um we are playing as Egypt, me and Seleucids, him, obviously. You can <laughs> see our the options down here. Um Yeah. Most important well some of one of the most important Actually, all of the options and almost all of the options are important. So, yeah. whatever you you can see, and we're playing on hard difficulty, etc. Well, and let's get right to it, shall we? Not. By the way, I'm going to consolidate this. Dips for Carthage and Rome. <laughs> Dips for the rest of the world. Hmm. No. <laughs> Nay, I refuse. <laughs> well, unless you become a satrapy, then it's, I guess it's going to be okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're gonna be my satrapy, you bastard. <laughs> Nine, thou fool. Uh, yeah, so whatever you want. Man, you have so many. I, I was just realized you have so many satrapies. As Seleucids. Yeah, I have like a thousand that are Yeah, and... Uh, Seleucids are kinda OP, both the multiplayer and the campaign. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. <laughs> but then... Like, th the massive income you're going to start out with. Bloody hell. But then again, I have the best... I can get the best military. The most diverse... Yeah, not support. really. Well... You have uh, inferior cavalry. Inferior cavalry. But that's that. That's the only thing, isn't it? Yeah, no, actually, I, uh, you you don't really have that many advantages, to be quite honest. Damn it! I just realized that your your units are, well, your un all of your units are more expensive than my ones. So, damn it! Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, are you loading up or? I'm nearly in. Uh, I'm I'm the one recording, so just take yeah. it easy, man. Take it easy, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. Alright. Ha, huh, and I already am involved with the... Atubabut. The what? Atubatu. Why are you speaking African? Because that's <laughs> just the kidding. name they, Just kidding, really guys. Thought. I'm not racist. I'm just making fun. Don't worry. <laughs> Call me your tits, <laughs> guys. African. It, it's, it's Middle Eastern for the first thing, so... It's Middle Eastern. I yeah. think it's... Africa. I'm I'm not going to yeah. speak because I feel like people are going to be very angry at me being so racist. <laughs> so yeah. 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 I, I wanna find out where Mick is so I can go and rape it. What? <laughs> I wanna find Mick so I can go and sack it. Right, you definitely said sack, sure. Sure. <laughs> yes. <laughs> this is fucking you dirty bastard. Ooh, I have a huge satrapy actually. The Selu. The what? Sia. The Selusia. Selusia. They're quite big. Well, how are they? They are. What are my satrapies? Why, d why do you say R like you're a pirate? R. Alright, let's R. R. I'm a pirate, Kevin. What? If I can give you a fair answer, you will have it. No, I accept you, fool. Whoa, 300, that's quite good actually. Do you get 300? I only get 255. That's. that's <laughs> I got 350 or something. Hmm? Sorry. Except for Come, my friend. Speak. I'm going to start the game out with some good trades with everybody. Uh, you should expand westward. That's pretty easy from yeah, what I have seen of Egypt. Yeah, I'm going to start doing that. And then begin to expand south to Axum. Mm -hmm. Hey, I have at least have Cyprus as my satrapy, which is one of the provinces well which you need. Lol. Well, you know, Cyprus won't live for long. Welcome well, you can't declare war on me, Come. and since they're ally allied with me, you <laughs> could just uh, break allies. Well, I mean, it's uh, that hard. 
That means that I, I will have to do that, and I don't want to break my lance with them, so... Yeah. Yeah, but anyways, uh, come on, Shivan. Finish your face. <laughs> I'm trading with everybody. You can You bastard. You can see the video, you fool. And, like, yeah. I'm literally going through every I greet you in my single person who I trade with. Almost everyone. Yeah. Welcome, friend. Welcome. Come. I think I will try and make an army of spent uh, Eastern spearmen and try and see what I can do with that. Hmm. Enter, right. friend, and speak. We surely That's have like much my plan in every single That sounds like a very spa um, Persian army in, like, from the movie 300. <laughs> just, spam, just have now a ton of awful of spearmen troops. and some of the worst archers and then just say, This is... Parthia, yeah. Persia, Seleucid, or this is Parthia. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not Parthia. Maybe I can make them to be. be Actually, I I can already see where Parthia is. I can see. I am Lisa. honored to receive this embassy. Really? Yeah. yeah I, I see. Yeah, actually, you know, every, almost every single faction over at the right side. <laughs> yeah, I that's like half a faction of the entire game. I so. So no, no. Uh, no so, worries. So from the start of the game, you have just re revealed the one core, like one fourth of the world already. <laughs> one third, actually. <laughs> one, f no one, no, not one third, one fourth. No don't, one third. Don't, don't get ahead of yourself, mate. Don't get ahead of uh, math, Shivan. You know I have better math. <laughs> anyway, so I go on, to HTX. I'll have to, you know. Uh, yeah, but I go to mathematical line on. STX. Yes, but HTX is obviously much better than <laughs> STX. So you're already taking that uh, rebellious province. It's not a rebellious. Well, yes, I guess they are rebellious, but technically they are not. Well, if you if you have played the campaign on single player, you would know they are rebels. Yes, I know. But Techn, but they're not. They're just not a rebel faction. Just us. Just pointing that out. Yeah. yeah. Wait, is this guy? Anyways, uh, um, is this guy even Jib? Um, yeah, he's he's definitely Tolmeg. He's so t Tolmeg that his name actually start with Ptolemy. So, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but Ptolemy. Anyways, uh, come on, Shaman. Yeah, making is much longer than it should be. It's already got like seven minutes. What? Who has got seven minutes? You have taken seven minutes. Really? Already? Yeah. Hmm. I don't care. <laughs> Just kidding. Well, I'm nearly done. Nearly. Just calm your tits. And I should probably speak. Properly. Um, is that it? I guess so. Your orders, my lord. Hmm. Alright, that's it. Nope, actually, not. I need to issue an edict. <laughs> Shepard the noob. I'm not a noob. If if anything, you are the noob right now. <laughs> Wait, it's actually you. Is it your turn? Yeah. And why is there a timer? There is just a timer. I just want to know why the hell would there would be a timer? Strange. Huh. I think I will dismantle my Indian war elephants. What? You will dismantle your elephants? Yeah, they, they <laughs> got 700 and so that they were mercenaries, so... 700 but Why do you... I wonder... Why would you... Bloody hell. That's a lot. <laughs> By the way... How much income do you get per turn? 3600 now. 
3600. That's actually not much more than me. Hmm. Awesome. Yeah, you bastard. <laughs> you shut up, you bloody bastard. Don't you make a fool out of me. <laughs> I wonder what I need to get to get out of it. Uh, oh, I can see it here. Elephant trading. You need it's to get elephant trading. The whole fucking lot of love. That's right. So let's get advanced chariots for now. And then let us see. I can't wait so I can build good um, research pl stations, places, things. Also, it's a sh shame that you can't do things at the same time in co-op. <laughs> what? Well, some little asshole faction didn't want to become my satrapy. Well, I wonder why. It surely cannot be because <laughs> you call them assholes. <laughs> they did not. They, they believe that they have a chance. Who is it? Uh, I don't know what they are called. They are called Masaka. At least that's their city name. No, they are... Uh, I have they, Hamlet. Uh, I don't even know what Hamlet is. They, they are Cappadocia. And what? Oh, Hamlet, that's purple dye. Apparently purple dye is the most expensive resource in the world. Seriously? Whoa. Yeah. It Pur gives a hundred wealth pe from maritime income. And for public order, 20 purple dye. Trade, trade stuff. How do you see that? Yeah, probably I should have... Uh, you just scroll over the city, but anyways, um... You scroll over the city? What, what? Probably have to indict, uh... Yeah, what to take? Nothing. Hurry. Hurry, tax rate. By the way, I should probably go to war with Adamatsu, I'm not sure. Yeah, I think I'm going to start going to war with Adam. I know. Whew. I'm uncertain about whether I should attack Hegra or Adam. The storm has raged long enough. <laughs> and the guys who just took a promise from the they now offered of me a peace agreement. <laughs> Differ. Alright, right, there's something wrong with my map. I know. Never mind. It's alright again. You clicked shift. How much money are you going to give me? Oh shoot. Damn it. Freaking. Your proposal has I that that was so retarded. I I I didn't even get money from them. That's What happened? I actually I was count giving them a counter offer and then it was just lacking a ton. And then I tried to squeeze some money out of them. And then I accidentally clicked the accept button. You can see in the video if you want to. Like uh, I can get a piece for 4,500. 4,500? You lucky bastard. I, I was trying to get something <laughs> like that. And that's always what they do when somebody tries to get peace with them. Uh, Unless I'm about to destroy them utterly. No, mm. uh, they don't want to become a satrapy. Who? Who miss it? The... We three. What? Well, for now I would just say yes and then I would come in and fuck him up the, yeah, in the next that's turn. that's also what I do. Just accept it for the moment and then a bit later just utterly destroy them. Hmm. But... Oh, you have to lose it. Alright, should we say that you may get... 
By the way, it, I talking about media? Yeah, it's media, not solution. You, you foul fool. Right. Um, shall we say that I get um. Well, it's right, because you made peace with someone that I've got like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine peace negotiations. <laughs> Just from um, yeah. Hmm. It's funny that when you are uh, Chris, I don't get a choice. Great, I'm untrustworthy now. Freaking great. Because that retarded yeah. us from before. You, you need to uh, wait a bit. Yes, I know, but... Before. I, I, was, I really didn't want to wait. Yeah, and I know. It, it's going to get better. After a bit of time. Although it will be extremely annoying. Yeah. You should uh, try and get some immediate, uh, immediate spearmen as soon as you can. They're quite good. Really? Well, I have. Yeah, I once uh, spent someone on nine and basically beat them with it. You and whom? I just once spammed someone online with uh, an immediate spam. Oh. Hmm. That's good to know. Yeah, it was one of the funniest thing I've ever tried. <laughs> what can I do for Egypt? Come join our ranks. You know what really annoys me about uh, about uh, this part of the world in what? Rome? What? That is that Jerusalem actually don't have the walls that they would have had in real life. Jerusalem had like four. F Two or three uh, major walls inside the city. Really? Yeah, they they had like one outer wall, then they had a wall behind that, and then they had the citadel. Hmm. Kind of like a Japanese fortress, just much bigger and. Uh, well, nice. Well, I guess that's just um. C I mean, they, failure when they made this game. I feel yeah. it's so annoying that I can't build walls like. It was some of, th like some of the things which I was most, no, something some, which I was very excited about was to, just upgrade, upgrade the hell out of my cities, just make them, yeah. super well, awesome. Well, well, I don't mind it. I just think it's weird. The Petra does, ha has the walls. I have never heard of a major fight around Petra. I have heard about the siege of Jerusalem, so it's kind of weird. Mm -hmm. Anyways, you. Probably should end up your turn by now. Or should I? What can I do for <laughs> I don't will in a moment. I live to serve Pharaoh. Are you ready? <laughs> I'm going to have seven s Egyptian slingers in one of my armies. Uh ha. Huh. Well, you should. I, I don't know. Uh, as Egypt, you don't have anything better than Egyptian slingers, do you? Be nope. welcome, emissary. Yeah, it's Rhodian slingers you get at some point, I guess. No, I don't. Well, I yeah, don't. Do it's mercenaries. Yeah, I'm not going to get those because they are threefold the cost in upkeep. And this is the third time. Uh, this is the second turn I forgot my, about my spy, which could go around inciting unrest so that's annoying yeah uh. by the way um should we say that i take all the provinces from arabia mauna and west of that and then you can take all the provinces from from uh, turkey from mesopotamia mesopotamia and north of that wait you you 
I can take all of those from Mesopotamia out of that. What what were you gonna say? It's not none of my uh, business, right? It's it's none of my satrapies or shit like that. No, I'm going to take them south of Mesopotamia. Mesopotamia is um the province which um media holds one of your satrapies, and I'm just going to take the provinces south of that. It's none of your business as far as I can see. Oh. So, oh, so south of Mesopotamia and my area, it's... Yeah, it's just south. Okay, cool. Anyways, I will upgrade my trade cities to basically be the biggest asshole you've ever seen. What? <laughs> You're going to upgrade your trade city cities to become the biggest, biggest assholes I've ever seen. Yep. What the hell? That's... <laughs> what? I... Yeah. I don't even. Yes, exactly. I don't even. <laughs> what can I do for <sighs> <sighs> yeah. Well, I. When all of these cities are upgraded, I will probably turn in a few hundred extra a, a ton. And I need to find out a faction which I can go and destroy. Let's go north of your satrapy. Actually, just. Yeah, go north of your satrapies. Take out the northern part of Turkey. Yeah, I think I will go for Sabo Sata. What? Uh, Samo Sata. So oh, yeah. Wait. Oh, Samo Sata. Oh, yeah. these guys. Cap so you're going to take out Cappadocia. Uh, yeah, I guess so. And then I will go for Galatia. And then for Asamot, where is Galatia? Where the hell is Galatia? No, oh, where the earth is Galatia? I marked it on the mini map. Oh, that. <laughs> <laughs> I love the drawings feature, it's the best thing about this game. Yep, it's. It's, it's awesome. the only thing they improved. I really like it, because I can just. We can. Ha we should hide uh, Galatia. I just saw a bird flying into the sea. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah. Rome logic, everybody. Huh. <laughs> Galatia is getting... becoming blue. And now it's going to become green again. No, I will not have anything with Cappadocia. They, if they want... If they absolutely want... Uh, uh, defensive treaty with me, they can stop be acting like assholes and do shit I don't want. <laughs> Alright, so they should st uh, they should stop being assholes by doing stuff well, that they, you don't want. Well, they, they just you offered me a uh, defensive treaty if I paid them 400. Alright. I mean, 400 is shit to me, but it's still like, why would I ever pay you a small little asshole city when I have like 10 regions under my control, or under my centropies. <laughs> yeah. Alright, for some reason... Yeah, I don't really understand it. <laughs> well, for some reason my thing seems becoming retarded. Again? At your command. Um, Shepard, you, you should probably raise an army at Para. Yes, yes, I, I, I have noticed, I have noticed. And Grey does <laughs> slums the Petra. Freaking hell! This is... This is some of the most annoying things to deal with, and that is slums. Like, it would be nice if, like, I would really like it if they would give you some heads up, like, ne slums imminent. Just give that you, uh, notification. Yeah, kind of like the, kind of like the thing they gave you in Shogun whenever your province were about to rebel. They would say, like, yeah. rebelling in imminent. Yeah, they, they, ha they also have that here. Which I actually think they put put in a in a patch because I don't think they had it for well at, at least I don't think it, it worked all the time for me, but mm. yeah. But anyways, come on, Shiban. <laughs> Bloody hell! Let, I have yeah, money to spend. Damn it! And I think I may go to f battle in a moment. Not sure though. By the way, I'm not gonna need to raise an arm here. Because I already have one, an army w with which is going to have ten slingers. 
It's not. <laughs> it's not overkill if it works. I remember in the first room, like the interest Egypt would be ten thousand spearmen or something like that. <laughs> or that was maybe the Parthian one. I don't remember. Um. All right, I think <laughs> I'm going. It's gonna go to battle. Ah, okay. Declare war. I'm. I'm going to steadfast again. Awesome. Yep. Who is the Bata? Now that's here. Yeah, who is that? Oh. Uh, can we do a light battle? Come on, Shimon, I want to see a light battle. A live battle? Yeah. Why is why are you calling it li a live battle? Because we're actually playing it. They got some fancy units that I don't even know what are. Which one? Uh, that's one man. Noble the sword. sword general. Yeah, then they're, they're nothing as far as I I remember. Yeah, but they are interesting nonetheless. Mm hmm. Ha! Huh, we we get to start right outside of a hill that gives us a fucking height advantage. Yep. Well, fair enough. <laughs> and you get to control my slingers. Because I don't feel like bothering to use them myself. <laughs> I know it's a great honor. You get to, yeah. you get to use one of the worst things well, you, in this. You really should game. not give me the slingers because uh, I kind of lost two here of coverage because of my slingers didn't really work as I intended them to. And how is that? Uh, basically, I just could really run away. Uh, would you give me the slingers? I would, but... Okay. Oh, wait. Hmm. You, you click on the gift button. Whoa. Gift <laughs> units. There we go. I've lost control of them. They, they have got... The green I will big. go from this side. Uh, I don't think they really have any cavalry that is capable of stopping me, so... I think they do. Didn't they have... I think they had one cavalry. They had a... Yeah, but that was an archer unit. I'm pretty sure I can... Alright, take this unit, unit. Take this unit just in case. Okay. Okay, I'm ready. Me too. A shame that they can see everything in the map. That's a bit stupid, in my opinion. For example, they can see my units over the hill, which is annoying. Huh? I feel like that. Like I feel. How how can they see your units? I think and it's how some, do you know it? It's, it's some defender thing because oh, if they didn't, I would have the the thing which marked that a unit is hidden, but I don't have it. And oh yeah. I think that's a maybe bit it's just the AI which get the bonus because no, it, we are it also high difficulty. Like it, if the enemy attacks me, it also I can always get that thing. And I think hmm. that's is, that is pretty Egyptian stupid infantry. in my opinion. Because I don't really mind it myself, to be honest. I mean, when when they're inside the city, it would really give sense, to be honest. Uh, like, I just you mean? like I shouldn't be able to see at, at the start. I shouldn't be able to see their units, and they shouldn't be able to see my units before the battle, battle begins, because else that gives them an ver a very unfair advantage, and they would be able to position position their troops much better. Yeah, but that would be how it would work in real life siege battles. You would know where the army comes from. You would know how they plan to attack. I mean, you you might not know the entire the entire story, but you would know at yeah. least. Yeah, I, I feel setup. like the, 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 something they could do about that to make that realistic is to just give a hint, like there's some enemies here, or there's a big concentration of concentration of units there, and not give ex an exact position of all the units. Uh, I think that would be kind of hard to do. I don't think so, but I suppose it could be a bit difficult. Ha, <laughs> try to keep an interesting name for units. Yep. <laughs> also, do you want to know something that's really annoying with Egyptian um, uh, garrisons? Uh, what is annoying with them? That is that some you know some garrisons they have um 
bow units and stuff. Like you are getting ash. shot by fire arrows. Oh right, yeah, that's... Oh really, they are. Wow, they have long range. If I could throw a spear like that, I would be in the Olympics. <laughs> Whoa, yeah. I mean, god, god damn it, they're all ro most outraging by skirmishers. Really? Yeah. That makes no sense. Um, you're atta getting attacked by from behind, by the way. Egyptian uh, maybe you should. Ah, I can see it. I'm not sure. I, I'm not confident enough in my Egyptian infantry. Really? Yeah, I don't even know if you should be confident in the Egyptian infantry. They yeah. kind of suck. They're decent. They're decent. Yeah, they. they no, can, they, they can they handle that really levy spearmen. Yeah, but I mean, uh, the the only re reason I could see of using uh, Egyptian infantry is if you're gonna do the Valound style and just basically spam infantry. Well, whatever you're going to do, just don't try to not get my units killed. I will try, I will try. I, I would like you to not try and get them killed. Not to try and get them killed. Well, that's my intention. What? <laughs> that's true. Nah, of course, it's no. not in my interest that your force get to clash. Hmm. Maybe if this was an easy, I would do it, but I don't really feel like messing this up. <laughs> I d I don't really feel like messing this up. Whoa! <laughs> Plus, are these skirmishers going to to run to hell if need if they need? I I could I I feel like these skirmishers are just going to to run to hell if I keep pursuing them. Yeah, well, uh, let my slingers handle it, and then take your force over and hold the town square. For some retarded reason, the enemy has decided that they're not actually interested in defending their fucking city anymore. Yeah, well, that's the AI for you. That's <laughs> freaking AI. The best AI CA ever developed. Yep. <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> really? Come on, AI. You're about to lose and you're you're really only having like a few men standing between you and victory. There, I uh, can do ease you that have one. the blood and gore, but yes, Chairman? Nope. I th think I'm going to get it for the next video. If it's possible. Yeah. Also, I, I've lost like n only one unit. Oh no, actually four units. Only four units so far. Huh? I've only lost four units. You mean four men? Yeah, four four men. Up. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you should probably push up your Hellenic Royal Guards. Yeah, I just thought that they would, were going to charge there. Well, that was that was very difficult, uh, man. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa, that was such a tra challenge, man. It's incredible. <laughs> Ah, uh, they say I uh, 24 losses to 910 kills. Yep. <laughs> and 20 of those losses were because, well, their skirmishes are kind of retardedly good. Yeah. Actually, well, actually, I don't think they. No, they didn't get any reinforcements. It seems like. Or, or maybe they, they did. did. They did. Yeah, they yeah, they yeah, stood right, like right. It, it was those retards not doing anything. Hmm. And oh. This is going very slowly. Is it also going slowly for you? Yeah, well, it's already got that. And occupy. Stupid occupy. And now I can upgrade my man. And I'm, and he's going to be a strategist because that's just awesome. And <laughs> recruit some. I can recruit mob. I can actually recruit recruit mobs because I have the slums. <laughs> uh, what? 
Wait, Slums gives you mob to recruit? Yep, a mob. Oh my! <laughs> they they cost five, five um, things per turn. Uh, five upkeep, and how much do they cost to recruit? To recruit? Twenty nine. <laughs> uh, maybe, maybe we should just try once and just make like two full stacks of them and just, just see what happens. <laughs> I, uh, that almo would be fun. I almost want to do that. Almost. <laughs> well, whenever you get like the point where you can have eight armies, then you should definitely try and do that and then just <laughs> with yeah, those definitely. shitty desert tribes. Yeah. Man, that was awesome. <laughs> How much time have we, have we been recording, by the way? Uh, good question. Two seconds. Uh, around 30 to 40 minutes. Alright. I guess we can record to one hour and then... And then, s like, stop the video. And I'll just cut it, cut it in two. Yeah. I feel like this I is going to... I guess we can do it there. I guess this is going. I feel like this is going to be an, a fun series, maybe. How can I assist a what? A fun series. Yeah. Hopefully, at least. Yep. Hopefully. Oh, it's a bird. Man, these birds are enormous. Have you noticed that? Huh? I just saw birds. a bird at the side at the size of a city <laughs> fly through my camp. Yeah, I, I saw a bird which <laughs> flew into the water. Yeah. And these, uh, I mean, these whole camels are just massive. Like they are the size of buildings, man. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, I actually have something called staples as uh, a what? Uh, as a lucid, you get both the ho hollow cigars. The hollow uh, The stable and then just Pericus cap. That's. Hollow Cinderos. The, it's the basic thing you do if you want many units. Yeah. Um, I can. But do, do you get as many units as I am? Like, from that building? Well, I, I'm going to um, check the Wikipedia and check your stuff. Factions. Uh, do, do that whenever the video is over. No, I can just do it now because I don't have anything else to, to see. And just watch. Uh, okay, fair enough. Alright, <laughs> I'm going to factions, clicking Hellenic, and then clicking Seleucid. And it just okay, moves click, back. Okay, click that you want to join my wall. What? Uh, join wall. Decline! Decline! <laughs> Just. I know it. Uh, of course, I, I, I actually, I don't have a choice, choice, mate. I don't have yeah. a choice. <laughs> Why did you declare yeah. war on them? You should. Because noob. they're bastards. Listen here, noob. <laughs> Mo see. First, you do this, and then wait a turn, and then do this. You see. But I don't have any reason not to. I mean, I have two garrison cities. It's not like they're actually capable of doing any stuff against me. Are you sure? Because, um... Yeah, I'm very uh, sure. In Tarsus? Two slingers, two eastern slingers, four mob, and two eastern spearmen. I mean, that's Whoa, a pretty mob. strong force. Whoa, you have a yeah, mob. Yeah, but, but I have eastern <laughs> slingers. Eastern slingers are good. Nah. Okay, I'm done with my turn. Alright. Hmm. Uh, I guess uh, whenever we get into the siege battle, we will. Uh, I mean, it it depends on what you want, but uh, if we we could just take the Sata siege battle would. Right, enemy has become satrapy. See this? This enemy of your faction has become a satrapy. You must either make unconditional peace with them or declare war on their overlord, which is Pontus. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> I, I don't fucking care about punters. Punters can come and suck my dick if they want. <laughs> Calm down, mate. No reason to speak such foul language in my channel. 
Yeah, sorry. Wait, what the hell? Sorry, everybody. Ch it crashed. Oh, what the f 